Hello, let's do some word games. So today, uh, I have a bit of a shorter list just because I don't have as much time to record and edit today. So we are going to do the instant wordle, the dordle, the polygonal, the zordle, the symbol, and the fusel, both, uh, both versions of fusel. So let's get going. Let's start with the instant wordle. And there's only one possible answer to this, and we need to find it. Hmm. Only I, oh, we have an E, I, or U available, so that's interesting. Maybe like, I don't know, I'm thinking GL, but I don't know what this W is doing. Could it be WHI or something like that, or WHE? But what's this G doing? I thought of like wing, but there's no N, so it can't be wing. And we can't do like wig because the G is not in the middle. What if it was something like G and then EW ending? Or start with G and then end in EW? What could that be? Like G, I, something, EW? That doesn't make sense. I can't put the W in the middle. This one's difficult. I can't do like DGE, but I could do like LGE? Like, like, I, like the word bulge, but put a W somewhere? Wolge? No. Yeah, how does how do these G and W work together? Hmm. Maybe it starts with W. So we could do like W and then obviously the G doesn't come after the W. We could put the G here, we could end in G. Oh, I see it. It's way. Let me just double check that. W E I G H are available. We check the columns, make sure there's not a repeated letter that I missed. Alright, I think the answer is way. Nice. All right. Well, that was a tough one for sure. Um, how long did that one take you? Because it took me a bit. So let's move on to the dordle, and we will start with way. That's actually pretty good for the left word. Wow, a WG word on the left as well. <laughs> what is going on here? Um, I have to think of another WG word. Wagon, maybe? No, the wagon doesn't have an E in it. Oh, it, oh, it's not wedge, because there's no E second. Well, I need the right word anyway, so let's get some letters for that. Um, I can't do tread. I could do pound, but I'd like the T and the R, I think. How about track? Track might be good. Wow, this left word has an A as well. W-A-G. Wagon is not spelled that way. Can't be wager. Could be something W A. No, G can't go forth. So I really feel like it would be E G like this. No, that doesn't make sense. Or G E. Waggle. Wag. Wagam. Waged. Waged. Do you think it would accept wage or wages? Let's um. Let's get the D and the S. Let's do sound. That's wages. Very interesting. That Dordle has a plural like that. All right. Unexpected. Um, I'm thinking of the word play. Oh no, it doesn't end in this one. Doesn't end in s. So I was gonna say plays, but it can't be for a couple reasons. The yellows don't line up right. It doesn't start with s or end with s. And the a. So I wonder if it's something like s a here. I feel like it kind of has to be. But then we don't have another vowel to go second, other than y. I want to do something like basil, but I can't put the a second. I could put the A first. I could repeat the A here and here or something like that. And then a say is a word, I think. Let's give that a try. It'll place the S in the A. Oh, or it'll just be correct. Nice. <laughs> All right. A say. Wages a say. All right. Let's move on. How'd you do on this one, too? Those are... Uh, the wages was unexpected because of plural, and a say is just a weird word. Double S, double A, and a Y. Let me know how you did on that one. Let's move on to the polygonal. Ooh, we have a six letter today. We're definitely turning on Hexpert for this one. Ooh, we have another sandwich here. So something like attack, I think, works. I think there's probably a lot of options, but we got to start somewhere. For a sec when that A turned green, I was like, mm, did I get it? But no, I didn't. Um, that's still really good to know, though. I'm looking at maybe a would, a would APPA make sense? No, it doesn't. How about A-R-R-A? A rage. Um, a raid. Uh, it doesn't make sense to me. Okay, how about A-S-S-A? 
Assays? <laughs> we can't end with uh, S though. If we use S as our double up. A sale? I think that's a word. All right, there is an S and there's an L. I think we're going to swap them. I think we're going to do this. A, la a lads. Um, hmm. I guess we don't have to. We could just end in ALS. Appalls? You can be appalled. Can you appalls? Apparently you can. It's not that. All right, well, what other <laughs> what other double letter goes here? Annals? A a annals. I think it's annals. There we go. I was worried I was in another trap. <laughs> Yesterday I almost failed because of the trap. Uh, someone did actually in my comments, which I feel really bad about that. <laughs> but there we go. Got another Hexpert solve in polygonal. Um, let's do the Zordal here. We are, of course, playing in hard mode as usual. So I can't start with the polygonal word. Let's start with the Dordal word. Let's start with wages. Go from there. Ooh, that was very nice. So should I try like swank? <laughs> Why not? SWA is correct. I probably could have thought of a better SWA word. But it may not be all in the same word, so we got to be careful. Let's place the D and get all new letters otherwise. So something like, I don't know what, um, fluid. Fluid gets all new letters and the D. Wow. I'm getting very lucky with these guesses. So we actually know this O is here too. So we have SWA and FLO in some order here, and the D is at the end. That's all the letters we know about. So let's think about what the two words would be. I think if it was SWA and then a D, that doesn't make sense. Um, how about FL? It's not going to be FW. So the F, okay, yeah, that's a really good thing to see. It's not going to be FW. The F has to go with something, so it's going to go FL. So FL and then an A or an O. And then someone ends with D. And it's going to be SWO ending in D or SWA ending in D. I don't like either of those. So I think it's going to be FL and then an O or an A. Oh, flood would make a lot of sense. Is this drown? We'll see. I think that is drown. So flood, drown, flood, and um, swamp, maybe? There we go. Drown, flood, swamp. Well, that's, uh, <laughs> that's quite the prompt there. Let's see. Ooh, this is huge. Um, let's see if I can show you this image here. So if I just zoom out, there we go. Now you can see the image. It's small, but there it is. Um, we got our swan here for some reason, <laughs> and we got a, a flooded area with a, a swampy tree, and it's a like a black and whitish beige-ish photo. So that's pretty cool. All right. Well, let's move on to the symbol, and we will start with Blaze, as always. I like the Blaze start. All right, we are gonna we're gonna follow up with Mouse. Mouse has done good. We, last time we did House, Mouse would have been better. All right, so E is placed. I'm gonna assume the O for now is in the middle spot. So we could try Trope, get some good letters. All right, I was right about the O, and the R is correct. So we are something R-O, something E. Drove. I was right about the V. Grove. I think Grove makes the most sense. There we go. Ah, uh, another five. That's a shame. Um, I'd really like my threes to catch up to my fives. Is that a good goal? It'll take a while, but I also these this includes unlimited. So if I play enough unlimiteds, maybe it won't take that long. Um, so yeah, let's keep an eye on that and move on to the Fusel. So this will be our last two games, the Fusel and the Blind Fusel. So we are starting with, we have to repeat a letter. Our symbol answer was Grove, which does not repeat a letter. So we're going to have to pick something else. Um, oh, the Zordal had Flood. Let's start with Flood. All right, there is one O, and it's not in either of these two places. Orange Hints. I think Sus Us will do a good job as usual. It certainly did. So this slot, we're going to switch to ABC for a sec. This slot is PQRTUV. So, and this one is also, what if we were double R ending in Y? 
Of course, I can't actually... I can test this R with, like, corny. I mean, that O, maybe it's placed. The O is not placed, so the O is at the beginning or the end, which is very interesting. There is an R, but it's not here, so I think this is going to be the R. Um... So now that we aren't going to get an answer about this one. So, hmm. Okay, let's think about this word. I'm going to go back to QWERTY here. I think, actually, I don't know. Do we start or end with O? If we started with O, we could do O-R, I guess. Actually, this can't be an R. The R is, wait, the R, the R must be here. The R is definitely here. We don't even need the clue there to know that. Because none of the other ones can be R because of the sus sus guess. And so then this one is not the O, not the N. So would it make sense for this to be a T? Oh, what if we were something like outro? Does U work here? U does not work here. We tried the U with sus sus. Outro was so good though. What about intro? Oh, we need an N anyway. Yeah, let's try intro. Nice, that was the answer. Sweet, figured it out. All right, let's move on to our last game, the Blind Fusel. Uh, there's certain letters we can't try. Unfortunately, intro, we cannot type because of that I. Do I want to do outro? Not really. Yeah, I'll do outro anyway. Let's repeat the O, see if there's two O's in the word. There are no O's in the word. Um, Sus-us is not amazing because I already tried U, T, and R here. Oh, uh, I didn't know it was coming. I said I should have I should have done something different, but I didn't know it was coming. Um, what about sassy? How does sassy look? Sassy's not terrible. Honestly, sus-sus wouldn't be terrible either. Let's just do it anyway. It, it eliminates a bunch of letters. All right, so this one, I think we end in E-R. I think that's pretty likely. We're not O-E-R though, so let's try, uh, can I do liver? I can't actually do a V here. I could do liner. Liner is apparently not a word. Um, liger, the animal, really? Is that spelled differently? Um, oh, I have to repeat a letter. Those were words. I just have to repeat a letter. So how am I going to repeat a letter? River. I can't do river. Can I do... What can I do here? Well, we don't... Uh, darn it. Can I do an E here, then? Like, fe I can't do fe... Well, I could do fever. I just don't need to know about that V. Something like feller or fenner, a word? No. Okay, what would I put here? An N? This might just be a throwaway guess in a, a little bit. Um, let's do let's do fever. All right, it does end in er. There's not a second e. Now I want to try liner. We don't actually know about the l i n, but we just know there aren't in those spots. Let's do an a here. And what what letters can go uh, in this slot? We can have an l. In that slot, we can have, I don't know if I want to try X, we could have a W in that spot, um, a D maybe, what else? Actually, I don't know about the W with an A. Um, well, what else would it be? A G, G is much better, and K. So we'll guess Calgd. There's an A and it's not second, so it's not an A-E-R word. We're going to get symbol clues here. We're going to get blues. So I guess we probably start with A then. We don't know there's no I. I could try abide. No, abide is not, doesn't end in ER. What was I thinking there? I was thinking about the first three letters and not the ER at the end. What is this word? It's a, 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 a word? No. Can't believe it wasn't K, L, G, or D. We know it's not an I here because the green clue would have been green. There's no way it's A-E-R like this, right? There's no way. Yeah, there's no way. It starts with A. We know there's not two E's, so this can't be an E. Not that I'd want it to be. P seems somewhat promising. It's something like ant. No, we can't even put a P here. Amber is a word. It's got to be amber. There we go. All right, that took me a little bit too long to think of, but we did get it. Oof, okay, not as good as the last couple days, but still solved, so I'm happy about that. So how'd you do on these games? Leave a comment with uh, any game suggestions you have, as well as how you did. And uh, of course, if you enjoyed this content, then why not leave a like and subscribe and share it with your friends, see if they enjoy it.
Um, let's try to expand our little community here. And I will see you next time.